Before any workout, it's really important that you warm up properly. So right now, the divas and I are gonna take you through a proper warm up right before we get into our upper body workout. We're gonna start with jumping jacks. Ready? Let's go. Remember doing these in high school? Well, they work. Now we're gonna transition to seal jacks, which is where we bring our feet and our arms out at the same time, and then bring our arms together. In three, two, one. Stop, now we go out. Out, in, out, in, out, in. These are a little bit different. They warm up some different muscles, including your chest. In five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Everyone get down on your knees. We're gonna do a stretch. This is called a pec stretch. As you can see, Kendall's arms are wide. Her left elbow is bent. She has her head turned towards her bent arm and her right arm is straight. And this is really stretching her pec and shoulder muscles. And now we're gonna switch switch sides. This really opens you up properly and it feels really good. How does it feel, Kendall? Really <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, and now we're on to our next exercise. Upper back activation. So what this is, it's called YWT. And you can see Shara is laying flat on her stomach with her arms up in the air. Now there's a slight modification here because Shara has her heels raised off the ground. That's a little bit advanced, but she's in the Y position. And now she's gonna move to the W. Now again, this is all about upper back activation. It's about great posture and holding yourself straight up. Now we're going to go to the T. You want to think about if I had my fingers in between your shoulder blades that they'd actually be squeezing my fingers. Again, this is great for your upper back and for posture. Now let's get into the demonstration of our first set of exercises. Before we get started, it's important for you to know what to do. Therefore, we're going to demonstrate each move at least one time before we get into actually doing the workout. We're going to start with the push up. Get into push-up position. Now you want your hands just about shoulder width apart. You don't want them any wider than that. We're gonna go straight down and then back up. Straight down and then back up. That's the first exercise. Everyone stand. We're gonna grab our heaviest weight, which are pre-placed for us, not necessarily for you at home, so you need to get a weight. We're gonna stagger our feet, bend our front leg, which is our left leg. Put your left hand on your left knee. Take your weight and we're gonna row. So that means you bring your elbow to your hip and you squeeze your back. And let's do that one one more time. Squeeze. You wanna be squeezing your shoulder blade into your spine. Now it's time to move on. Let's put our heavier weight down. And we're gonna grab our lighter weights. We're gonna do lateral raises. So keep your hands straight and looking forward, except for a slight modification. If this is too hard, you can turn your thumbs up to the ceiling. Ready? We just move our arms straight out to the side with a slight bend in the elbows. This will really work your shoulders. Now we're gonna demonstrate our next exercise, which are bicep curls. Now, the only difference you're gonna have here is you're gonna move your hand to the weight. So sort of let it slide so that the weight itself is resting on your hand. And what this does is it exacerbates the way that, that your muscle works. So it really makes your muscle torque that much harder for that bicep peak that you'll hear about. So your hands are neutral, you bring them up, you curl, and you squeeze. Our next exercise is the tricep kickback. You only need one weight. So please put one weight down. Again, we're gonna get into that staggered position. You want your back and your head to be a straight line. You're gonna bring your elbow back and only your hand is gonna move up to the ceiling. And again, up to the ceiling, squeeze that tricep. 
and down. Put your weight down. Is everybody ready for, for this workout? Everybody ready? Ready. Yeah. The divas are ready. Are you ready? This first round, we're gonna go eight reps for every exercise. Let's go. Starting with the push-up. Now remember, keep your arms in and your elbows tucked. Here we go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Stand up, grab your heavy weight. We're gonna do our row. Left leg forward and bent. We're gonna row with our right arm first. Let's go. One, two, three. Remember, squeeze that back and think hand to your hip. Two more, one more, and switch. Now we put our right leg forward, a slight bend, right arm on your right knee. We're gonna row with our left arm and go. One, two. How does that feel, everybody? Feeling it. <laughs> Remember, bring your hand to your hip and squeeze your back. One more. Great. Now we're gonna do our lateral raises. Remember, this is with the lighter weight. We're gonna be raising our arms straight out to the side. And here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Slight bend in your elbows. Six, no swing. Seven, eight. Straight into our bicep curls. Remember, move the weight down so it's touching your hands. And here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's put one weight down. We're gonna do our tricep kickbacks. So we're gonna start staggered again. Left leg first. Left hand on your left knee. You want your body to be in a straight line. Bring your elbow back and it should stay locked. Now we're gonna extend. One, two, three, four. Four more, you got it. Five, six, seven, eight. Now switch sides. Right leg in front, left leg back. Right hand on your right knee. Bring your elbow back and extend. One, two, three, four, only four more. Five, six, squeeze your tricep, seven, eight. Great job. Put your weight down. Now you can get some of your water. Take a little bit of a break before we get into the real workout where we're gonna do 12 reps of every exercise. Is everybody ready? Ready. Yeah. Now what this workout does, it's really great for toning your arms as well as your posture for, for standing straight. Are we ready? Yeah. Let's get going. You guys ready? Let's do it. <laughs> Let's get down. Push up position. Remember, keep your core tight, keep your butt squeezed. Here we go. We're gonna do 12 this time. And start. One. Two, three, four. Make sure your elbows are bent underneath you. Now, if push ups are a little bit too hard for you to do, then you can be on your knees. And we have three more. This is a modified exercise. Last one makes it a little bit easier. Remember, now we're going to grab our heavier weight. We're going to get right into the rows. Left leg bent. Hand on your leg. You want a straight line from your head to your back. And we're gonna row our hand to our hip. Here we go. One, two. Come on, you could do it. Squeeze your back. Five, six, seven, eight. Only four more, you got it. Nine, 10, two more. 11, 12. Now switch. Right leg forward, left leg back. Hand on your leg, and 
One, two, three. Do you guys feel it? Four. Feeling it. Yeah. Five. Yeah, because... This is how you get a great muscular diva-like back. Come on. Only three more. Two more. Last one. Okay, keep going. Grab your lighter weights. We're gonna do the lateral raises. Here we go, out to the side. One. Keep a slight bend in your elbows. Four. Where do you guys feel this? Shoulders. Shoulders are on fire. Shoulders, that's right. Nice round shoulders can make your waist look even smaller. Just a little incentive. Two. And last one. Keep your weights in your hands. We're gonna go right into the curls, remember? Slide the weight down so that it touches the side of your hands. And here we go. Curl. Two. Three, come on, you could get through this. It's not that hard. Five. Six, that's right. Do it. Seven. Eight. Nine. Come on. Woo. 10. Two more. 11. 12. We're gonna put one weight down and get into our triceps. Left leg forward first. Remember, keep that straight line. Right elbow back high and lift your hand to the ceiling. Two, three. A lot of women complain about having flabby arms in the back. This will really help tone your arms. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Two more. Come on. Eleven, twelve. Now switch. Good job, everybody. That's right. Here we go. One, two, three, four, come on, five. Keep your core tight and your back straight and your elbow high. Last one. Great job, everyone. That's an awesome workout. And again, just as important as it is to warm up, it's important to stretch. Let's take our right elbow with our left hand and pull back. Really stretch it out. Breathe. <laughs> it's a hard workout even for, for the divas. Now switch. Pull your left elbow with your right hand and again, really pull, really feel that stretch. Okay, now we're gonna take our right arm across our body with our left forearm and pull it. You can feel the stretch in your shoulders, right? In your back. Feels good to stretch. And the other side. Really work it. Okay, now we're gonna take both arms. We're gonna pull straight down and open up your chest. And make sure you breathe. You worked really hard, you earned this. And that's it for upper body. Great job, you guys. Yeah, good job. Thank you very much.